The FAA is proposing the largest fines ever against two passengers for unruly behavior, and one of them was on a flight out of Las Vegas. It happened last July. The FAA says the woman tried to hug and kiss another passenger, then tried exiting the plane. She's also accused of biting another passenger. The FAA has proposed a $77,000 fine. In fact, in all of 2021, the FAA launched more than 1,000 investigations into passengers disrupting flights. In many cases, those people will get physically or verbally abusive towards pilots and the flight crew. Current laws allow passengers to ban, I should say, allow airlines to ban passengers, but it doesn't stop them from finding a different carrier. And that's why many are in support of a universal no-fly list that airlines can share. It's been way overdue, and uh, we need to just get this done so that we can protect the, our passengers, our crew members, and the safety of our skies. If you're going to disrupt the operation of the crew, then you will no longer fly on airlines anymore. An attempt to pass a federal no-fly list was cut short back in February when several Republican senators pushed back. They said it would equate unruly passengers to terrorists and would bar them from their constitutional right to freely travel.